Hi everyone! I hope you all had a nice March break. In the past few weeks, we've been talking about Jesus' disciples. Do you remember what we learned? Yeah, we learned that we are His disciples and apostles. It is, and it's so wonderful to follow Jesus because He loves us so much. Following Jesus means that we get to share His love with people who don't know Him. It also means that we want to be like Him. That is to love and to serve people. That's right! But sometimes bad things do happen. It's not always easy because people may treat us badly. They may pick on us or make fun of us and we could get hurt. Yeah, following Jesus is a wonderful thing and gives us lots of joy and pleasure. But it's not all about making us feel good. Another thing we need to remember is that because we are still sinners, we need reminders and guidance and we need to ask for forgiveness. Yeah, and he gives us what we need. His love, forgiveness, and guidance. Next week is a special Sunday called Palm Sunday. We celebrate Jesus going into Jerusalem for the last time. The following week is called Holy Week. We follow Jesus' footsteps of his final teaching. Then, Sunday after that is Easter. Yay! Today, we want to talk about Jesus' final teaching. The story will tell us what kind of God Jesus is and what it means to be his disciples. Here we go! Jesus and his disciples had a special meal together. Then Jesus wanted to teach them that a leader looks after others. He got a bowl of water and a towel. I am going to wash your feet, Jesus said. His disciples were surprised. Jesus knelt down and began to gently wash their dirty feet and dry them on a towel. Peter was upset and he said, Why are you doing a servant's job? You are our most important leader. But Jesus was showing them that a good leader isn't too important to do anything for other people. It was Peter's turn, but he said to Jesus, I don't want you to wash my dirty feet. But Jesus said to him, But Peter, I am being your true friend and showing you how to look after the people. Then Peter said to Jesus, Then wash my face and hands as well. I want to learn how to look after other people the way you do. From the story you just heard, what kind of God do you think Jesus is? He's a serving, giving, and loving God. Yeah, he also doesn't just tell us what to do. He shows it to us. He demonstrates how to serve others, forgive others, and love others. Sometimes it's not easy to forgive someone who's mean to us or do nice things for them or even love them, but that's what Jesus wants us to do. We love because he first loved us. Yeah. Next week on Palm Sunday, we will hear all the events that have happened during the Holy Week. Some of the events are very sad, but they're all necessary for Jesus to save us. And even more wonderful things will happen on Easter. So let's look forward to that. Let's sing a song, God is Love. Praise Him, praise Him, all ye little children. God is love, God is love. Praise Him, praise Him, all ye little children. God is love, God is love. Love Him, love Him, all ye little children. God is love, God is love. Love Him, love Him, all ye little children. God is love, God is love. Thank Him, thank Him, all ye little children. God is love, God is love. Thank Him, thank Him, all ye little children. God is love, God is love. That was great. Let's pray. Dear Jesus, thank you for loving us. Thank you for showing us how to serve, give, and love others. Please help us to be like you. We pray in your name. Amen. Amen.